Hi guys, you are watching the Clever Build DIY channel. In this video, we will talk about the water leakage protection system used in washing machines and dishwashers. Such protection is not available on all models of washing machines and may be present in them as an additional option, an option for which the buyer will have to pay extra. Various manufacturers of washing machines and dishwashers use a water leakage protection system, and each manufacturer gives this system its own name, for example, Bosch or Siemens calls this system Aqua Stop, and the name Aqua Safe is used by ASCO. Giving different names to the system, the essence of the mechanism of action is not very different from each other. So, protection against water leaks, it doesn't matter if it is a washing machine or a dishwasher, the principle of operation is the same for them. The leakage protection system can be divided into two types. The first type, it is also called, incomplete or partial protection, is as follows. In the washing machine or dishwasher, in the lower part of the case, there is a special tray for collecting water in the event of a leak of any of the equipment components. Hoses, valves, washing machine tank are all located above the pallet located in the lower part, on which a special float with a micro switch is installed. As soon as water from a break or a leaky connection begins to accumulate in the lower sump and the float rises up and turns on the micro switch, the leakage protection system will work. After the micro switch of the float is triggered, the washing machine or dishwasher closes the water inlet valve, turns on the drain pump, and an audible alarm can also turn on. Such a system protects the owner from possible water leaks inside the washing machine itself, but does not protect against a possible breakthrough of the inlet hose leading from the water main, and therefore, after using the washing machine, to prevent leaks when the hose breaks, it is necessary to shut off the water supply with the tap. Another type of protection against water leakage is a complex solution in which the inlet hose itself is protected. In such a system, when a leak inside the body of the washing machine leaks, the solenoid valve closes together with the water pumping pump. And in case of damage to the inlet hose, the hose itself also stops the water supply. There are several options here, which differ in the principle of operation and the interaction of the hose itself with the system from leaks. In both systems, the hose has an internal, so to speak, main hose and an external one, which is a sealed sheath. There is a gap between the inner and outer hose. In a simpler system, in the part of the hose connected to the water main, there is a body with a special shut-off valve, which is held open by a magnet or spring, and is activated during the expansion of a special absorbent that reacts to moisture. When the inner hose ruptures, the water that has got between the two shells of the hose flows into the body with a shut-off valve. The absorbent located under the valve, from the water that has entered, begins to increase in volume and thereby activates the shut-off valve, which, as a result of pressure on it, blocks the flow water into the hose. The disadvantage of such a system is that the inlet hose, even with the very protection against leakage, without blocking the valve of the supply water pipe, remains under pressure. Therefore, when using such a hose, after using the washing machine, it is recommended to turn off the tap anyway. Such actions will help to protect the hose from undue effects of surges or increased pressure in the water supply system. The second option is considered a complete leakage protection system, it has established itself as the most reliable. In this system, a sump with a float and a micro switch is also used, which now interacts with the hose itself. Such a hose also has an outer sheath. The difference is that in this hose, in the body that connects to the water supply, there is a full-fledged solenoid valve connected to the electrical system of the washing or dishwasher. In its natural state, the valve is closed all the time, it opens only during water intake, this option protects the hose itself from negative effects during idle time. Manufacturers of equipment with such a system argue that it is not necessary to turn off the water supply valve to the washing machine or dishwasher after each use, but they advise to do this only if the equipment is left unattended for a long time. The principle of operation of such a protection system differs from the previous one, let's look at it. During the operation of the washing machine, if the inner hose is damaged, Water that gets between the two shells begins to flow through the drain pipe onto the tray of the washing machine. When the float ascends, the system switch is triggered, after which the water intake valve located in the hose is immediately closed. Also, the electric valve in the device itself is closed, after which the water drain pump is turned on. 
This system is currently the most advanced and is used by many manufacturers. Doubters, perhaps it is worth thinking about a comprehensive system of protection against water leaks, installed in the water unit of the apartment and disconnecting in the event of a leak, the entire plumbing in the apartment at the same time. Separately, I would like to say about the so-called mechanical safety valves positioned as a water leakage protection system, and sometimes recommended for installation on washing machines and dishwashers. Their principle of operation is quite simple, and the protection is questionable. Inside the body, there is a movable valve held open by a special spring. As soon as the passing flow increases its speed, a break in the hose is implied, the pressure on the valve increases and the spring is compressed under the increased water flow allowing the valve to enter the seat and completely shut off the water flow. I would like to say right away that such a system is very unreliable, since its correct operation is highly dependent on the external water pressure and the rate of the past water flow. Such a valve will not shut off the water, for example, due to a partial rupture of the hose, from which water can flow for a very long time and without any valve reaction. Since the valve will perceive the water passing through it, like a regular set of water in a washing machine or dishwasher. Of course, if there is no protection against leaks at all, the use of such a valve according to the principle, at least something, is possible and will be justified, after all, the valve with some degree of probability will be able to protect against complete hose rupture, and this in any case minimizes the risks. You can see more details about testing such a valve in my other video, the link to which will be in the description or in the attached comment to this video. And on this, let me finish, let your household appliances never let you down and will only delight you. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel, I wish you all good luck and see you soon.